King. I see myself on Twitch. I see myself on YouTube. Westside Coog. <laughs> if you're still here, can you hear me? Okay. Okay, I think I finally got this working. I don't know what happened there. The first two things, I know why. That I, I had something toggled off that should have been on. The third, that was just random. YouTube just didn't want to do anything. Okay, so again, for the fourth time. <laughs> okay, going through the options. Join the Thunder Lotus family. Let's you sign on to the newsletter. When I first saw this, my first reaction was, that sounds very Square Enix-ish. Square Enix-ish. I don't know why that company in particular came to my head, but it did. Anyway, then the options, nothing fancy, just music, controls, language, and the option to let me change controllers, which I don't want to do. So I'll just do a new game. For a second, you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that would have been, would it not? I'm Charon. That's what he said. Well, that is what I have been until your arrival. I cannot say that I'm sad to leave, but still had a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you'll have to pick up where I left off. It is, after all, my very last day, and you are... Stella. Stella. Welcome. I see you have brought a friend here with you. What's his name? Daffodil. Daffodil. You two will share the burden then. And take over from me. As I said, in a few minutes I'll be gone from this world, and that's why you're here. You'll be the new spirit Listen. bearer. Listen, your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they're ready, bring them back here. Dying souls can't pass away on their own. You will have to help them fulfill their last requests and be at their service until their last breath. The big round bridge over there is the Everdor. The Alpha where everything starts, the Omega where everything ends. That's actually kind of Omega shaped. <laughs> this is where all the quests get completed and where existence meets its threshold. There is no task more important than this one. Never forget this. There's something I need to give you. Now be re really careful with it. It's the Everlight. Symbol of your status here and the only tool you'll ever need. Wait, what are you? How highly inappropriate. Yeah, cats do what they want, man. Well, that settles it. The ever light will help you through your travels. It'll be the light that shines in the darkness. The last remaining hope of the, of the departed. is a flame, the light that never falters, the beacon of eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there's no greater duty than this one. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. 
I was overwhelmed too at first. Just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You'll soon get used to this place. Accustomed to these moments. You are the new spirit bearers after all. One thing. Once I'm gone, you'll have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you and will fade away once I'm gone. You might find one not too far from here if you keep rowing to the right for some time. Probably. This time, here I go. So long, Stella, and good luck. You'll need it. Is the volume too loud? Or is it pretty good? Control. Oh, and there goes the boat. Plush. Oh, I can swim. First B to jump, hold B to jump higher. And I fell. Drop. Mm -hmm. Stella, it really is you. Stand up straight and let me get a look mm -hmm. at you. You look good. The daffodils here too, mm -hmm. I see. We'll have to find a lint roller then. <laughs> it might not be that obvious after all. Mm -hmm. It's me, Gwen. Good thing you found me. I have no idea who Gwen is, but apparently Stella does. She looks extremely happy. Mm -hmm. but if you're here, it means, oh, you are the new spirit mm -hmm. bearer. You are the one replacing Charon. I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. <laughs> I've been stuck on this disgusting island for about a week, living off sardines and cigarettes. Mm -hmm. That sounds unpleasant. Funny how I used to be one the one getting you out of trouble before. I can see you have an Everlight mm. now, of course. See that boat over there? No. Okay, that's a pretty big boat. Mm -hmm. That's the one. Mm -hmm. It was obviously slightly shabby, but let's commandeer it. I'd wager it'll work since you're the, fair, the spirit fairer. Okay, meet me on the deck over mm -hmm. there. I'll explain mm -hmm. it all. Oh, she poofs. One second here, my wife saying that she thinks the internet's slow, and I just did a test and it was fine. Suggested she like reboot the routers and switches at her desk. Okay. Sploosh. What? Oh, she's riding on the ball. That's so she doesn't get wet. That's kind of cute. What is that? Empty shell. Sit on the couch. Pet the kitty. 
Okay, that's weird. Okay, so B... I had to push Y to leave. But B wouldn't do it. Over here. Mm -hmm. Okay, here goes. Hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. jump for joy but this feels good much better than anticipated mm -hmm. so the way I see it this boat is yours now don't you think mm -hmm. good and as you're the spirit fair welcoming stray spirits is your new job once aboard they will assume their true mm -hmm. forms well that's my theory anyway why are you looking at me mm -hmm. like that you need to come here and give me a hug Alright, so it looks like the D-pad and the joystick do the same thing. Okay, pushing A gave me this wheel. I can give food. Oh, okay. Here, I, I thought it was like a Bioware type of wheel where I actually had to change the direction. But it's just left or right. Moves it. Mood or hug. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, you asked with a hug. Why are you surprised mm. that I'm giving it to you? Mm -hmm. Come with me now. Let's take a look at this chaos. Alright, let's... Alright. X brought up inventory. L and R do nothing yet. Oh no. Mm -hmm. What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia's old yard. A beautiful, unorganized testament to someone's mm -hmm. laziness. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this, or my dust allergies will be back. Let me mm -hmm. think. But aren't you dead? Do you, do you have allergies when you're dead? There's only one way to clean this up. You have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. Use your local shipwright. And his jokes are garbage. Do I really need to meet him then? But he's the only one who can fix mm -hmm. your boat. We should head to Albert's shipyard. You must be wondering how to make the mm -hmm. ship move. It's really easy, actually. Here, let me give you this key I found on the island. It'll unlock the cabin mm -hmm. in the back. We should find a map projector in there. How do I know all this? Well, I was planning an escape, mm -hmm. remember? And you know me. I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. Go, open up the cabins. Mm -hmm. The map projector should be simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's shipyard. Alright, press minus to view active requests. That's what I was looking for before. Upgrades and shenanigans. Can I bring the bell? You can bring the bell. Can I do anything else here? Okay, that's kind of off-putting the way this is set up. It literally is a projector. I was not expecting that. That's the ever door. That's a whole but of nothing. It shows me the XY coordinates, which tells me I'll probably need to be taking a lot of notes. I like how she drops down, kind of like a... Whee! Mm -hmm. As I understand, the ship is powered by your Everlight. 
That's how it cruises the ocean and reveals the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. I must admit it. It's quite fascinating. But I know you must feel overwhelmed. Chair in the ever door, the spirit fairs, this place, this boat, me being here. It's a lot. You must be wondering what's going on. Truth be told, I don't really know either. But I'm here for you. I'll do my best to keep you, to help you, and try to make sense of it all. Excuse me. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore the ship. You can even give that fishing rod a try. The world is your oyster. What fishing rod? There was a bird here. I can sit in a chair. Oh, that's the fishing rod. Hold it real. I got a herring. Is it red? I guess the thing on the left must be the distance to get to my destination. Ah! <laughs> a boat was disappearing. Again! <laughs> oh, now she's just playing with it. Like I say, yo-yo. Okay, and we got... Looks like a day-night day cycle, maybe, showing up in the corner. Here we are. Hello. I'll head down to Albert's shipyard and update the blueprint. Uh, upgrade your blueprint station. It's the only way to clear this clutter. I'm curious about what's Hello. made out of. Considering the smell, I'd say at least seven different types of dirt and dust. So... To go into the little boat. Oh, that's what the ore was from. I didn't catch it the first time. The ore was made out of the ball. Go over here. Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where my prices are a customer's best friend. Are they all zeros? I'm Albert. Been in the business of shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you are the new spirit fan? How, how would you know this? Is it, was it pups, posted in advance that I was coming? Why would anyone assume that? Of course you are. You've been able to start this ship and bring it here, after all. The wind was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. Let me see what you have here. Nice little dinghy. Funny how it looks exactly like the one I built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. <laughs> Charon was unhappy about his gloomy and dank arc. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer was always right, so I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boat. Old habits die hard. But don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this alone. Is it Tom Nook all over again? Let me tell you something. You know we always joke about the construction here. Don't worry, we're still working on it. Oh boy. Work on the jokes. With a little bit of love, this bird will be resplendent again. The first thing you need is a proper blueprint table. Since it's your lucky day and I'm feeling generous, I'll offer it to you, free of charge. Why don't I believe you? There's a catch. I just know there's a catch. And the cat just meowed. Mind you, it's still a bit bare bones. 
in terms of functionality. But the, the subsequent upgrades will come at such a small price, you'll want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. Talk or upgrade. Okay, so I have Blueprint Station. Beginner, obvious, craftsman, expert, master. Of which are not free. They cost some of whatever currency those circles are. The Exploring Curl is a small-sized boat that will always get you where you want to go. Interpret Otter is a medium-sized boat that will make you s slip away in style. That is not locked, but I don't have 1,200 units. Everything else is locked. And I can get a mailbox. That's probably my first improvement. That's just the only thing unlocked and the cheapest. All right. So we got a guest house, garden, field, and kitchen. Now well, that was instant. I was expecting a little bit of an animation. The next upgrade is a hobbyist for 400. <laughs> Wait, so... I thought that was a different boat, but I guess that is my boat, just look, looking at it from the other side. I'm confused. you would be able to build and edit your buildings on your boat. What a treat. But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and in pleasure, on your go. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers. Finally. Good. Albert gave it to you for free, and he said he loaned the ship to you. Mm -hmm. Ominous. See? I'm not the only one thinking this. Hard to know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Right? Anyway, let's focus on the task at hand. Cleaning up this deck. You can go to your new blueprint table above your cabin and select the move option. You think you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Mm -hmm. Go for it, I'll wait down here. Where am I supposed to go? Why am I so zoomed out? Can you zoom in? Is that salvage building? Oh, what? What? Alright, I guess I want to have X to salvage. I get two old shoes and three empty bottles. Ugh. Not sure why I'm so tired all of a sudden. You did a wonderful job. And the good news is you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. Unnecessary amenity. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Newly welcome spirits such as myself will have a temporary place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep, not really. 
I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. Mm -hmm. But it beats sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave you to it. Have fun. <laughs> okay, I guess the currency is glims. And the upgrades di require additional components. Build a guest house with the blueprint table. Hey. Did she just refuse a hug? The accidental hug I tried to, I almost gave her? Build. That's the guest house. Oh! <laughs> I can elevate it. But I don't think I want to yet. But that is kind of humorous. You can only build one of these. I wish the zoom in and out were a little more snappy. But at least it lets me run while it's doing it. It just seems weird. <laughs> this guest house is very pretty. It has your touch. Nice work as usual. <laughs> now at last I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, wait. <laughs> what is going on? Something else is happening. <laughs> ah, I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. <laughs> very hungry. You know how terrible a cook I am. Why, why is she so happy to know that she's not a good cook? <laughs> but, I, but I remember you being absolutely fantastic mm -hmm. at it, and you might have fished a few fishes already. Trouble is, I can't really eat an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fish boat and never survive. Mm -hmm. Isn't he already dead? I'm confused still. Oops. We should keep on using this blueprint table of yours and build a mm -hmm. kitchen. I'm pretty sure I've seen the plans for it in there, as well as the necessary resources. You require bright mm -hmm. jelly, and there's only one way to get some. Mm -hmm. I Look, I should have told you when I first met you here. Something scares the hell out mm -hmm. of me. The dark presence, and I even cower from it. A void that swallows all, light included. It can take many forms, and for me, it's always jellyfish. Mm -hmm. It's so fully aware of the irony. The bright jelly you need for the kitchen, well, only these jellyfish can provide it to you. So there's no mm -hmm. other option. I'll have to face my fears. But you're mm -hmm. here. With you, I can do it. There will appear as a dark patch of pure fear on your map, so you can't miss it. It, the first thing she said wasn't ominous. That <laughs> I'll go take, take some time to prepare myself. Okay, I can I can go in. Can I look around. There's a picture of me on the wall. How arrogant am I? I can still sit down on the couch. It's too dark to navigate. It'll be a possible again at dawn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's refusing my hug. What's mood? Okay. So mood is a scale. And you get perks depending on moods of people. Mm -hmm. 
Yes, I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your upper light being well light. Or some other technicality. Mm -hmm. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck under the stars. I'd suggest you go to sleep too in that cozy little room atop mm -hmm. the cabin. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go. And the ship will start again in the morning. Oh, and speaking of that, you know me. Waking up on time has never been my mm -hmm. forte. You, you ring that bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the mm -hmm. right time. Around 7 o'clock should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Good night. So how do I know what time it is? Is that the circle in the corner doesn't exactly tell me that it's midnight or 3 a.m. or whatever. Sleep till morning. Yes or no. L to toggle the clock and trajectory display on and off. Okay. We have crates of food. Jellyfish stage and crates of food. I wasn't expecting this to be a resource gathering game. Sleeping standing up, apparently. And I can't talk to her. Alright, I guess ring the bell? Morning. Oh, now I can. There. Mm -hmm. Don't ask me how, but I, I've met Albert already. He definitely is a shark. But his interest in all things maritime will be mm -hmm. helpful, such as the boat upgrades he sells at outrageously high prices. With those, you'll be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like classic mythical challenges again. Mm -hmm. A bit cliche, if you ask me. Is that a game being self-referential? Alright. Mm -hmm. We'll take the hug this time. Mm hmm. Hmm. Alright, okay, that increased her mood. It was recently hugged. So, is, is there a hug timer? I have to wait a certain time before I can hug people? Alright, let's go see what I can do here. Let me check these crates first. Scare the birds. Try fishing again, since I have nothing else to do. Let's 
Yeah, she looked way too happy when she caught that fish. The game was zoomed in a little bit more. You know, they actually have a chance to look at the art that's being drawn. Oh! person all my life. everything I can do here. More fishing. See what I got. Inventory. Key. Old shoe and old carpet. Oh, is that like a sell value? Coffee bean seeds. I can plant coffee and corn. on one with bright jelly. Mm. It should be visible enough. I said, pop as many as you can, you'll get glimpsed away. We'll wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay mm. out there. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. What am I doing? Seems like way too zoomed out. Um,
getting money, so I guess so? Tumbling and diving like a shooting star, without the slightest fear or hesitation. Definitely haven't lost your touch. Have you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen? Go for it. I'll be patiently mm -hmm. waiting. Slowly digesting myself. Oh, that... Rude! Alright. I, I can at least move to these crates. While I'm building. Field or in the kitchen. <laughs> okay. So I can build it on top of the house. Uh, it's Let's not do that yet. Yeah, I wish the game was more zoomed in. Like in general. Maybe I'll... Maybe I won't feel like that when I'm playing it on a bigger TV. But I'm just... Playing it on a 24-inch screen that's cropped because I can see my my stream border, so it's more like a 20-inch display. 20-inch display. You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put in one ingredient in the oven. And wait for it to be cooked. You can even try these loose corn kernels that I've been hanging around in my pockets. Ew! Packet food! I can't wait to see your cooking glory again. You got this. Recipes. I know nothing. So let's start with a fish. I have to put a, the component in the oven first, then push X to cook. Anything else so shiny here? That it <laughs> it turns into oven mitts. Oh, did I not let it cook enough? Let me check my inventory again. What did I get? A valuable ring? Right, jelly is a gem from a jellyfish. What? Apparently I didn't let it be in the oven long enough. So let me just try that again. Oh, I see on the wall there's a timer. I have to wait for the timer to go off. More waiting. Even the cat decided to pass out. Oops. 
you know, if this was EA, there'd be microtransactions to speed it, to speed these up. <laughs> It's not great right now. Really? You don't say. Alright. Kind of wondering how I want to wait outside and see if it, what, if it no gives me some sort of notification. Oh, it's almost nighttime again. Ding! Recipe, grilled fish. I can smell it. Here, let's put the corn in there and let that cook. Oh, that doesn't take long at all. But that was fast. Learn popcorn. That's a weird looking shape. could eat anything. Just give me some food. It is hungry. Meal size snack, dish type comfort. Meal size small, dish type plain. Well, I won't die just yet. It's better than I thought it could be. I've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Can, she looks way too happy. I don't know. Experience don't run on sunshine and water. But don't they? <laughs> Since when do spirits eat? She remembered. I've always loved comfort food. I would die for a cup of coffee. But I'm not that picky, I can eat anything. Sure. The people who say they aren't picky are probably normally the picky ones. They're just trying to be polite, but kind of not at the same time. Mm -hmm. It's never the same thing twice. See? It's always something. Boy, here's something I was supposed to give you. I'm not sure exactly how it works, but an obel is a symbol of passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay you, but something tells me you already... you knew that already. <laughs> no! I did not know that already! Thank you for teaching me this. Mm -hmm. Let's keep on improving this craft. As you must have seen in your blueprint table, there's both a field and a garden, mm -hmm. which means you can grow many different things and turn this ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my mm -hmm. opinion. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it around here, and you can grow flax in it, which in turn will be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should buy seeds to use in it, but that'll come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called Mostine Cove, and there's something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. the field first or the garden first? Well, I don't have lightning in the bottle yet. I don't have enough limestone, so I don't know how to get all this other stuff yet. I guess that comes from this other destination that I can't go to because it's dark now, but... Sleep on me. Mm -hmm. 
Alright, this game is definitely slower than I thought it was going to be. Not saying it's bad, it's just it takes a bit to ramp up. about her new journey. Oh, okay, she's got... Oh, okay. As she... Since I now know that her coffee... She likes coffee and she likes comfort food, so that gets populated. As... So, kind of like a, a log. And now that she's in the... Fourth... Mood, I have more perks. I can use a loom, whatever that is. Well, I know what a loom is. I just don't know in the game where it is. She's not talking to me anymore. Yes. Go here and see where it shows me. Okay, that's the island. I thought actually had, she had to tell me, like, actually talking, but I guess not. I wonder how big this map gets. Okay, I guess Y is about 250. Minus 182. Ooh, XY is the line. It really gets up there. Good size X. And there is. Oh. That's a zoom out. That's as, that, that's as zoomed in as it gets, huh? a field so I need more limestone and more logs here.
magic oven mitts. Yes, that was the, the the first time I used them. I didn't. I don't. Yeah, uh, it was the first, the second time I used the ore. When I realized that the ore came from the orb, the first time I completely missed it. But yeah, the oven mitts I caught that right away. Okay, now what do I do now that I'm here? Something you to tell me? The Yog calls herself a spirit, yet she's alive enough to uh, require food and hugs, apparently. Mm. Mm. Let's see what happens when I give her some of the popcorn. Mm. Because that's mm. her favorite food. She's eating popcorn with a fork. <laughs> Alright, so what am I supposed to do now? Yeah, the elk was smoking. So this is something new. Hummingburg. Which shop? Okay. This my yeah. I'm guessing it's just a, a generic eating animation that just looked funny. Okay, we give her popcorn and she eats it with a fork. All right, let's. Uh, I think I have one fish left. Let's start that cooking. And I'll do more fish while I'm waiting for the boat to get to where I need to get. Seeds to grow? I think that I think that goes I'll end up getting those from one of the other, one of the destinations. I need to get other components before I can build the, the fields. Do you have to collect to build? What do you have to collect to build on the boat? Um, well, in order to get to build the field, I need more logs and more limestone. I have a few of each. One one limestone. It is pretty chill. I'm kind of getting like an Animal Crossing vibe. On it's very. It, it isn't rushing you to do anything.
that was that's still marked as new. Yep. Let's go there again and see if like whatever I was supposed to trigger maybe didn't trigger. If I leave food in the oven, it'll burn, or is it? I'm wondering. I've always kind of wondered that. I haven't found a way to salvage the, those logs that were in the water. Just the just the crates. Okay, yeah, this this didn't trigger the first time I went to this location. I don't wonder if I missed or what? It's on easy mode? What do you mean? I'm confused. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. We? Does that mean you're coming too? Yes, she is. Mm -hmm. Bottles. Here we go. Mm -hmm. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine. I promise. Mm -hmm. It's the best way to get the wood you actually need. But don't worry, they'll regrow, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. No burning. Oh, cooking mode is easy, yeah. Really? That's how it's going to work? That's kind of messed up. Raspberries. Congratulations, for you have become death, the destroyer of worlds. Took aside. That's how you do it. You go on ahead, cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to the boat, build the fields with all the maple logs. We'll be next to the raft. I don't know. I don't like how that worked. <laughs> Have you played this before, Abyssal? Or are you, just, are you seeing this for the first time? Still m missing the limestone. Just, just raise her up while she's in the building, huh? I can do that. A 
Okay. Yeah, this is the first time I've played it, too. Hopefully find another limestone. Not even gonna come down, huh? So just gonna stay there? Mm. It's not gonna be great about now. Sure it would. Do you like a berry? Mm. No. I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I've tried. I just can't. Well, I obviously didn't know that. But now I bet, yeah, fruit is now what it's like. Sell it or definitely leave about it stops and we start once everyone is back on board. Yeah, that's convenient. Oh, well, dive! Yeah. Alright, there's the other limestone. Mm -hmm. Shells do, but I'm getting shells. Common muscle. the same, so... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't have a limestone. The first two things I got, I fished out of the water like that with the glowy was a limestone, so I can't make a field yet. say. Guy. Oh. 
<laughs> I'm out here looking for the right house to start a family. My wife sent me out to find something that might fit our needs. A garden, maybe a pool. Hmm. I'm not asking for much. I just can't decide. I know you can't help me, but it helps to say it out loud. Mm -hmm. I might stumble on the rarest of finds. Well, that seemed random. So this is a town of sorts. I don't get to see what's inside, huh? That's weird. I hope my next game will be ready soon. I've crunched the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon proficiency from the mountain gnome race, there's a nifty synergy with the level 3 rogue ability. <laughs> Clearly! We have an RPG or here. It's for sure a bit weird, but hey, 5d20 and auto crit on prone can't be defeated. Am I right? Okay. Did I just kite some seeds? Like out of nowhere? Like from that someone owns those seeds. And I just took them. I'm confused. Uh, this Am I supposed to be able to see something? Cost one of two stars, but I don't know what even a star is, and apparently I have one. jumped up on something. I'm sorry, I'm in a bit of a, bit of a rush. Aren't we all? I'm going home. Don't follow me, please. I hate it when people know where I live. If you know my address, you'll tell people. And then they'll tell people, listen, I just don't want junk mail. Oh, well, let me guess. I'm a bit of a psychic, you know? Psycho, maybe? Your name is Mary? No. Marguerite? No. Missy? Wait, no. Is she? Don't tell me it's... Oh, shoot. I'll get it. Someday. A local shop raccoon. Hey! More raccoons and tanookis? Owning shops? We've never seen that before. All useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Oh, good day. Stroll a day keeps the doctor avoid, which reminds me I haven't been to the doctor in forever. Oh no, why did I think about health all of a sudden? Am I suddenly starting to feel all well? I'm not sick. I'm okay. What's she doing here? She didn't come with me. I'm browsing for fiber. Um, congratulations. That's a locked door. Thud. Talk by cell. Step right up, potential prospect. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing Hummingbird since forever. You've got the glims, I've got the goods. I've got all the wares to make you spend those hard earned glims. Step right up. Whoa! Only f for the low, low price of 500,000 glim. What? What? I'm confused.
So again, I'm still kind of stuck then. of wood. Apparently I can. Maybe. Uh, but, you know, my, my current quest is to build the field of which I still need a limestone. So, let's... Okay, we have this new area in a stormy field. But, uh. Hmm, more crates spawned down there. Guess I'm gonna go there first. And then I'll work my way back up. shoe. Yay me. And later on in the game, do I buy a faster sale out of an auction? <laughs> I got three shoes in a row. And she's still way too happy for having done done that. Dang, my burnt wood's done. Well, I got a fish. Okay, I'll make coal out of my burning wood. Well, I think it's... Oh, okay. I didn't think it actually uh, mm -hmm. stopped there, but just I'm traveling through it, I guess it still counts.
Oh, I didn't know I could stand up there. Really? I fall right through the whole mob of them and don't hit a one. Grilled veggie. <laughs> Thanks, game. in the oven? I don't think I thought it works. What were those green things with the jellies? Um, they... Where's my inventory? They are bright jelly, which was a... which is a component... was a component used when I built the kitchen. say now. Relax. You need to calm down with that bell. When you ring it at night, people will get up. Nobody likes to be looking at Especially me. I've got a weird feeling it makes me rather hungry. She doesn't like fruit, so let's see if she likes the veggies. I'll say no, not yet. Vibrant necklace and a limestone. Used to find guardians in another life. It no longer has any use, should be sold.
Okay. So, I guess all these items should be sold. Okay, oh bowl. That was the star. I need one more of those in order to get the double jump. A bottle filled with considerable amount of glim. Okay. There's a little genesis qua to it. Simple but elegant. Mm -hmm. all, all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. Mm -hmm. But you know me, I would kill a plastic cactus, so I, would, I wouldn't take... <laughs> so don't take my word on this. There's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore special specializes in mm -hmm. seeds. He has set up shop in Hummingbird, the busiest town in the area. Theodore and his brothers are the founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with <coughs> very loose moral values. Yes, this world is a serious problem of dubious business practices. Mm -hmm. Since I don't want to get swindled, I'll come. I don't want you to get swindled. I'll come with you and do most of the talking. Mm -hmm. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once, and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingbird mm -hmm. thing. We need to find some seeds for that field. Uh, I have some seeds. Are they all garden? Okay. Field. Okay, the carrot seeds are garden. So yeah, I have three things. Can I use them? Or do I like, have to wait for what's his name? limestone over there that I could have picked up but didn't find. Oh, it would have been nice to know. After this next trip into town, I'll gonna end the stream. Been live for about an hour and a half. What, what was that? I should 
try to remember to go by there again. Let me see what that was. So I guess I needed to talk to her fur first. I thought she, she was going to go on the boat like last time, but apparently not. Did she still show up? Hmm. Take a good look at the shrine. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are meant to resonate with the spirit fair mm -hmm. or the Everlight. A furnace monument has a power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. Mm -hmm. Two slots on it need to be filled up. I'm probably certain you could use Ubles to activate it, but to get Ubles you need to welcome more spirits mm -hmm. on your ship. I'm sure you'll find more souls, lost souls like me. So I know I have So as like a quest but not a quest? I don't get it. Adam, thanks for watching. Um, so far, it's pretty good. It's a very slow start, but it's. I think it's like that's. I think it's the point of the game. It's a whole thing's kind of a chill thing, kind of like Animal Crossing, but has more of a storyline to push you forward. What was that? Mm -hmm. Those prices are out of control. I won't let them get away with this. Are you ready to see me obliterate this merchant? Yeah. Yes. Good. Let's do this. So, Ibisel, there you go. I guess this is the quest that drops his prices. Theodore, I know what you're doing here. And you should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. <laughs> People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. Ouch! Wow, that was harsh. What? Adam, what is the meaning of this? Mm. My friend here is the new spirit bearer, but she's not a newbie. And neither am mm. I. That little scam of yours won't work on us. Ah. But I i can assure you, my business practices are quite above board. Mm. You warned, you treacherous striped weasel. <laughs> I won't tolerate uh, this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses, mm. just fair prices. Hey. I, I, so stop being dishonest at once. And next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. If you start being smarter. <laughs> mm. Got it. <laughs> but, yes, yes, of course. I promise you I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. Mm -hmm. Hey, you. Yes, you. Your friend really gave that greedy merchant some help. Mm -hmm. You both look like you could possibly use uh, join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your uh -huh. eyes. I'm not going to lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited, uh -huh. though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You have to be able to jump in inhumanely high to make it. I guess you can also use the stairs in that house. Uh -huh. But some other idiot lost the key. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever. Okay, that was random. An excellent salesperson always carries what the customer needs. So my well-off patron, what can I do for you? Okay. Yeah. Let's just chop 99% of the price. So 
I guess I can buy one of each. Oh, oh, okay. It's not 94. It's 70. It's 70 for one. Or 50. But that's 50 is his inventory. So I'll buy my f some of each. That's garden, so I'll wait. That's garden, so I'll wait. <laughs> Yeah, let's sell the stuff that says that is sell. Can I not sell it? Apparently I can't sell it. Alright. You've got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want, I'll meet you at the pier. Stella, if I call it correctly. Never forget a face, especially if they have shiny glam. Don't be shy. Have a look if you fancy. Still expensive, but better. standing there. Mm -hmm. That's great. Now you can plant seeds in there. Give it a go. How? Is that a door? Oh, yeah, that was a door. That's not a door. So I guess I got three stalls to grow stuff on. Let's do one of each. It looks like they need water. Mm -hmm. The thumb is as green as your hat. This boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget that you'll have to water the plants once mm -hmm. in a while. Don't ask my word for it, though. My gardening, my gardening knowledge is as limited as my father's empathy. <laughs> Oof. You have to find better mentors mm -hmm. than me, which reminds me, I believe it's time for you to find new people. Mm -hmm. Not that I don't love the idea of just the two of us cruising the oceans, but you are the spirit fairer. And spirit fairers find spirits. Mm -hmm. And yes, help them fulfill your last wishes, however mundane they may be. I've heard of a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I'll bet you'll like this one if he's who I think mm -hmm. it is. Go, let's sail. All right, here I think is where I'm going to call it. Um, I, I'll, again, I like the game. I was expecting, I wasn't expecting it to be so s chill, and but it's, it's again, it's not a, that's not a knock against it. I'm okay with it. It just wasn't what I was expecting. So this this is does sound like something I might be able to get into off and on instead of having to like drill through it like I normally play games. If I stop playing a game, I normally can't get in. This one doesn't so far doesn't seem like that type of game. So I'll be able to kind of jump around again. So t I'll try to play another game tomorrow. I don't know if I'll stream it, but I want to get get another game in before. The, um, so I can talk about more than just two games on next week's podcast. Okay. Uh, for those of you who are still with us, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later.